James Charles is in a career crisis right now and the controversy surrounding him shows no signs of slowing down. But the disintegration of his friendship with fellow beauty vlogger Tati Westbrook isn't the first time he's faced public scrutiny. In February 2017, James tweeted quotes from an alleged convo between him and some friends saying, I can't believe we're going to Africa today. OMG, what if we get Ebola? James, we're fine. We could have gotten it at Chipotle last year. The backlash swiftly followed, and the makeup guru later deleted the tweet and apologized. I am extremely sorry, he said at the time. Regardless of my intentions, words have consequences. I take full responsibility and will learn and do better. In an interview the following day, he tried to explain the situation. My friend confused E. coli and Ebola for each other. I thought the mistake was funny, so I tweeted the conversation, but I posted it without realizing what the tweet as a whole was implying. Just weeks later, James' former friend, Thomas Halbert, tweeted screenshots of text messages allegedly sent by James that seemed to confirm that the senior photos that helped make him a star had been something of a fabrication. When James tweeted out the photos in September, he claimed that he'd retaken the portraits after bringing his own ring light to the studio with him to ensure that his highlight would be popping. But the text messages seemed to imply he photoshopped the pic instead, with James allegedly saying, if you expose me, I'll kill you. But I know, call me Joanne. In April 2019, Charles caught flack again for his comments in a video where he insinuated trans men aren't real men. I mean, no, there have been girls in the past that I've like thought were really, really beautiful. There's also been like trans guys in the past too that I was like really, really into for a moment in time. He later issued another apology saying, I am very, very sorry. If you are a trans man, you are a man. If you're a trans girl, you are a woman. You are valid in your identity. Then there were those who took issue with his comments on Met Gala, where he appeared to conflate influencer representation in the media with minority groups who genuinely struggle for representation. Throw in his current public feud with Tati, and it's clear James' career trajectory has been a roller coaster ride. He's now apparently in hiding and has apologized yet again following the latest scandal. I'm so disappointed in myself that I ruined a relationship that did mean so much to me, even if I didn't do the best job of showing it all the time. Most of my career over the past few years has been about me making mistakes and trying to learn and grow from them. And I haven't always done the best job of that. I can admit that. Um, but I have always tried. Will it be enough for fans to uncancel him? That remains to be seen. <laughs> Thirsty for more celeb news? Make sure you subscribe to the E! News YouTube channel so you can stay informed on all the breaking updates. Come on, you know you want to be the first to know about all the latest hookups, breakups, arrests, and so much more.